So now as the computer, I'm going to design a little um, extension cover for this exact problem. Um, I have this little uh, power extension cord in my case as well. And again, it does take up a bit of space inside the case that I need um, to mount fans. So I'm going to create a little cover that surrounds the plug um, just to make it look a bit nicer. My go to CAD software at the moment is definitely Fusion 360, free to use for home usage. And while it does have a pretty steep learning curve, um, it's just so incredibly powerful. It's basically overkill for the stuff that I'm doing, but I've taken the time to get used to it and I can basically do anything in it now that I need to um, design um, for 3D printing. So a little time lapse to So back again, um, I came up with a little solution for the bottom fans in this uh, case. As I said, the case, um, the space at the bottom is quite restricted. Even when I put in um, 120 millimeter fans, um, the access to the I.O. ports on the bottom of the motherboard were really obstructed. So if that's already the case with 120 millimeter fans, there's basically no way I can fit uh, 140 millimeter fans down there and still um, plug in my USB 3.0 front uh, header. That's not gonna fit. But since I do have a little bit of space um, between the GPU cooler, um, I thought I would design a little shroud that I will screw to the bottom panel of the case that then first of all adapts basically the fan size from 120 on the bottom to 140 millimeter fans and i can also perfectly align in terms of the thickness of the fans to the heatsink of my graphics card so there is minimal to no um, gap so i could even rest the gpu on this um, fan shroud 